Hello everybody, this is Backblast. Here we are doing 80 days again. It's day two of my recording. Day three in the game. Uh, we've found a member of the coach meters. We're in Paris. We've got somebody from the Coachmakers Guild to carry us to Amsterdam. There were other options, but it meant waiting a day or two, and I wanted to get going. Um, she loaded the case onto the back, stuck the boiler, took off at high speed along the coastal road, swerving around each corner with cons considerable skill, and I think a, some, a touch of showmanship. Excellent. I clung on tight. This would be a terrific ride. I am now zestful. I'm full of zest. Um, let's converse. Ooh. Greetings, driver. I cannot tell well if you're talking to me. Um, ask her about Amsterdam or change it to Christiana. What's Christiana? Let's talk about Christiana. I have the times for a journey from Amsterdam to Christiana in this pamphlet. On the subject of boats, I've heard one can travel by fisherman's boat from Gladivostok to Pyongyang. But the journey is a tiring one. And that's a long way, actually, Pyongyang. Um, yes, Vladivostok's the other end of the Trans-Siberian Railway, so... Um, so where do I want to go? I'd like to be able to see the map. Um, ask Elaine about Pyongyang, Christiana Stuck, Copenhagen, Helsinki, Warsaw. Warsaw, there we go. Is there a route from Christiana to Warsaw? Maybe, but some buyers will pay well for geometric equipment from Warsaw. So there you go, so that's good. So that's good. We want to we wanna go to Warsaw. Do tell me more about Warsaw. Do you know the collectors in Minsk will pay fantastic amounts for accordions from Warsaw? Right. So that goes to Pyongyang, apparently. That's a long, circuitous route. It appears to be going in the wrong direction. So she's going to take us to here, isn't she? Um, once or twice, the metal rim wheels lifted the chassis clear from the road on one side, only to bump down after a chuff and a puff. More of the engine. A chuff and a puff. More of the engine. Uh, we were jolted around so much like poultry as the wind whipped through our hair. Uh, oh, a ghastly state of affairs. The Polish inventor, Bozek, who had first attached a perfectly decent locomotive engine underneath a flimsy wooden crate, had a lot to answer for. Uh, such cars are growing in population. I set about contacting ways to ease our suffering. No. Such cars were growing in popularity, starting from their use in farmsteads and extending up through the classic. It was said the King of Sweden now do one. There were those who said it would be privately owned, yes. It would soon be privately owned and not just by members of the Coachmakers Guild. As we rattled along, I spoke to our driver. No, we're speaking to Fogg, I think. I attended to Monsieur Fogg, concerned he would be suffering as I was. Somehow, I had to ensure we did not travel in cars again. Yeah, I haven't really enjoyed it. Either. I think Christiana's up here. Some of our possessions will trade well here. Uh, let's, let's make a plan. So our plan is, what do we do? Do we go to Christiana? So we've got Christiana, which arrives... It, it departs in two days. Can we get to Berlin? I think I need to uh, maybe maybe speak to some people. Uh, is there nowhere I can go and, and chat to anybody? Or is it Christiana? It, it, it departs in two days. We we don't want that. So a hotel. We'll pass the night here. Uh, though the people of Amsterdam move about its canal-sized streets with a sense of optimism and good cheer, I, pre I felt no pressing need to linger. Yes. Our own mission left little time for exchanging pleasantries. I found a street peddler who greeted me with a cheerful smile beneath a caterpillar-like moustache. We're going around the world, I said. I, I haven't decided on what accent I'm doing here. No, we are going around the world. Uh, what is the cheapest way out of the city? What is the fastest way on from here? That's what, yes, or no, uh, that one. We're going around the world, I declared. Aha, he replied, you are like the influenza, the peddler reached into his pocket. Buy an apple, one pound? Yes, let's have an apple. I bought it and took it with a smile. Uh, fastest or cheapest? Come on, cheapest. What's the 
What is the cheapest way out of the city? Apparently I'm now German, as he mused. Most likely the hydrofoil heading north to Norway, he shrugged. It's fine enough if you don't mind being jolted around. Well, we've just had enough of that, thank you. And it's not exactly going around the world, unless you don't mind which way. Hmm, is it fast? Two days, I think. Well, no, not really. What's the fastest way from here? Car, I suppose. What car again? The roads are good, the canals used to be better, but now they seem almost out of date. It is a curse to be rich in the past. By the time the future rolls around, you are poor again. Mm, I find the rich mostly stay rich, which is true. He shrugged, and I began to wonder whether that truism would apply to my master after our journey was done. I thanked the peddler and moved on. So many choices. Uh, funds have gone down a touch. Ah, we now have options, look. So, whoa, 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 whoa. No, no, where's my map? Where's my map? Okay, right, so what, what choice have I got here? So Copenhagen arrives tomorrow. It's £41 and it's by car. That arrives on Sunday. Departs tomorrow. What is that? Is that train or... A private car? Bozek. I think this is better. I, I, I think Berlin's better. Let's let's, let's see if we can adjust it. Uh, thorough, thoroughly ungentlemanly behaviour. Six hundred and twenty pounds at eight a.m. Oh dear, no, I think so. Uh, I think oh, it looks like we're going to Copenhagen or maybe the hydrofoil. That arrives Sunday. That arrives Sunday. That arrives Sunday. Well, they're all arriving on Sunday. This appears to be going round the world, so we're going. We're having that. To travel this way, we'll have to stay the night. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. Let's... let us... explore. Let us explore. See? Look, see, look, look, look. It took a few hours to explore, investigating the various options for how we might continue our journey. Um, so let's plan. Quick, quick, quick. Quick, quick, quick. Um, Munich arrives Monday. No, no, no. Right, we're going. We're on that one. We're doing that one. How do I do that? Well, minus 16. Hearts. Okay. I can take two bags with me, can't I? Um. We can go by. Is there only car? I have no idea what this this means. <laughs> Is this all the people playing? Am I racing other people? Um, we're going to the, we're going there. To take this journey, we'll have to spend the night. Okay, well, we're spending the night then. See, the other option is to get down here, but it arrives a day later. Right, I want to do that, but I don't know how to do it. I, I don't know what to click or select or anything. That's what I want. That's my route. Okay, good. All right. Well, we're going to have to sleep here then. Okay, good. Open the luggage. Oh, I've got apples. I've got two bags now. Oh, uh, can I sell things here? Where am I? Where? Am I? No. Can I? Where? Yeah, where am I? I'm in Amsterdam. Amsterdam. Okay, I think. Right, that's what we're doing. We're doing that, sir. Uh, but I don't know how to get off this screen. <laughs> Seriously? I don't know how to get off the screen. So hotel we've got to, we've got to pass the night I'm afraid 100 okay we what remain of the day I starch the collars or uh, yes gotta make sure he looks nice don't we starts the colors of our shirts to ensure everything was ship shape for our departure so let's depart so we're going to Berlin 
Drive a car, let's go. Um, the roof has two suitcases. It will be uncomfortable. It'll be a bothersome route, but the evening jacket from our war should make the master more comfortable. Okay, well we're off again then. Private car. That was a rubbish option. We're just going to go around the car by, around the world by car. I beg Monsieur Fogg, no more cars. Not too soon. Would he be moved? Oh no, and we climbed. Preparing to journey another few hundred miles to the heart of Germany. We had the same driver as before. You too, she exclaimed. Get in! Get in! Well, what does that do? News. Paris welfare, a roaring success. Well, that's great. Do, 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 do. I want to get to Warsaw. Uh, every bit as enjoyable as I had anticipated. Um, yes, it's not my place to complain. So I weathered every bump and dip in the road, but I cannot say I relished a minute of it. Perhaps Monsieur Fogg did not either. Certainly, though he, if he truly enjoys anything, I have not discovered it. He didn't express any joy, but merely attempted to read his newspaper, which flew about all over. Relations have strengthened slightly. That's good. Beep. Oh, what's that? What? Uh, let's converse with Fogg. What's your wish, Master? Why, my dear? Passport to uh, journey. Where do you want to go? Um, how is that progress? Day five, I believe. Early days. It says day six. Um, apples? Give him an apple. A rare pleasure. His well-being improved greatly. How are our funds? We are quite comfortable. Very good, sir. Right, what do we do from Berlin? So, really? Come on, we want something good from here. Not a car again. We made good progress in the car. I was in agony, but I'm a Frenchman and we do not complain. Finally, we came upon sight of tiled roofs, the harbour and the smell of herring. We had arrived in Berlin. Now, I've never been to Berlin. I'm sure it doesn't smell of herring. Relations with fog have strengthened. So, where now? Uh, the geometry equipment should be quite valuable here. So, let's get rid of the geometry. Um, the covered market in Alexanderplatz echoes with voices. A Caribbean timetable. That might be interesting later. Um, we'll get an extra suitcase if we want. Uh, what's the gear do? Um, it's unfavoured by engineers and now extremely valuable in Khartoum. That's a long way south. Part of the railway man set. In fact, if I don't take either of those, we're still carrying one suitcase. So I think we're good here. So, ooh, there we go. This is the Caribbean routes. So this might be useful later. Havana. Excellent. Oh, I'd love to go to Havana. I've been to Havana in real life, and that'd be brilliant if I could go there in the game. Berlin? Ah, yes, the gate. Um, okay, 7pm, we're going to have to stay, aren't we? Pass the night here, he says. We stayed for the night in the Hotel Adlon on Unter den Linden, the main boulevard in the central meat district. From the window, the Brandenburg Gate was lit by upturned gas lamps. And there it is. I decided to... I went for a late night stroll. I'm hoping to see some way out of Berlin. Past groups of people drinking at low tables. Um, I sat with the man who was demonstrating various engine noises. No, he's probably a nutter. Um, a pair of ladies? Yes. Who were each trying to out-drink the other. <laughs> Let's join in. I might get robbed. A foolhardy move for one accustomed to the petit cognac and not the grand pichet. When I returned to Monsieur Fogg, I was in somewhat less than steady state. Still, I had discovered that merchants in Astrakhan will pay a huge amount for candles scented of rose from Bucharest. Uh, we, he's, my relations have, have gone. But we can explore in the morning. So I'm, I'm, We've got new routes. Oh, look at that. We can get to Warsaw from here. Berlin, they tell me, was once filled with the glorious sound of people speaking French. Not so anymore. <coughs> Excuse me. Now there is nothing but the crashing of gears. It seems so foul on the streets we did not go out. <coughs> Let's go for the crashing of gears. Every street corner is equipped with rotisseries and wheeled systems that spin glass globes this way and that. Their purpose is quite unclear. But when I investigated one, do, 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 by throwing by... Uh, clambering up the pole 
Using my acrobatic training, of course. Much to my master's horror, I found it was solid crystal sphere with no openings and nothing inside. The mystery persisted until nightfall when these globes all lit up and the people of Berlin clustered around the warmth of the globes to drink beer and converse. It seems they work hard here, but they celebrate with equal vigour. Um, well, after last night... Yay, let's get drunk again! Oh, he's not happy. Uh, we joined the merriment, <laughs> earning ourselves the offer of a lift all the way to Bucharest. From a stocky blonde man who spoke only in dure monosyllables. Uh, I s mono uh, syllables, thank you. I s sipped at a bug, of, a, a bug of mere with a thick head and recoiled in horror. These friends put wheat in their beer. Fiends put wheat in there. The afternoon turned to evening. We finished our explorations of Berlin. So this guy says he's going to take us all the way to Bucharest. Which would be fantastic. But what is that? What is it? Is it... Uh, it arrives there tomorrow. It's horse and carriage, isn't it? It's saying horse and carriage. What does Warsaw do? That arrives today. And I wanted to go to Warsaw. Accordions from Warsaw. Geometric equipment from Warsaw. Let's go. North German Express to Warsaw. We've got one suitcase. And this looks like a bearable route. We're off. We're on the train again. Well, folks, I'm going to leave it there. I uh, hope you're enjoying this series. Give me a thumbs up, thumbs down. Let me know if you like it or not. I will be continuing around the world in the next episode. I've been Bat Blast. I'll see you next time.